What's up guys? It's Laura from Reading in Bed. Today is Tuesday, December 20th. So we're gonna reveal the 20th story in the short story advent calendar. And I'm doing these videos every day until Christmas. Thanks for watching. Um, Henry's sitting with me today. Yeah. Hello, Henry. Okay, so Henry, um, should we show off the books that Daddy bought? Yeah. Imagine my surprise when yesterday I received a rush order from Amazon. .ca, uh, that I wasn't expecting, and I thought, oh, maybe someone got me a present. Well, no, no, my husband uh, had ordered a couple of books after drinking a couple of beers, and this is what happens when you drunk order on Amazon. <laughs> the Farting Animals Coloring Book. Farts are funny, cute, and silly. There are actually two of these. Don't ask me why. <laughs> um... And then, is that a coloring book? This is also a coloring book called Unicorns Are Jerks. <laughs> and finally, very confusingly, there was a board book called Dancing with Jesus, including such dances as the water walk, the carpenter clog, the temptation tango, the temple slam, Where's my favorite? Uh, where, ah, yes. The Last Supper Stomp. You just got served. <laughs> don't, I, yeah, I have no idea. Yeah. I don't know. <laughs> That's silly, isn't it, Henry? Very silly. Ah! Okay, so let's talk about yesterday's story real quick. This is number 19, and it was called Babies on Fire by Missy Marston. Was it okay? It was really good, but it's a little inappropriate for kids, unfortunately. Um... I said on Twitter that I felt like this was just taking a peek about 15 years in my future. Uh, it's about a 49-year-old woman, and um, I thought they what were... What comes after game. 49? What do you think comes after 49? 4010. 4010? 40, <laughs> <laughs> no, it's 50. 50. So, you, no, okay. Well, anyways, um, I'll write in the description box what I thought because we're having a bit of a chaotic reveal today. So let's, oh, look at 20. Okay, let's show the camera first and then you guys tell me what you think. That's a dollar oh, bill. A dollar bill, but what's the dollar bill in? A, bu a hamburger. A hamburger? No, a no, subway. 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 No, Subway. Subway? Yeah, French bread. Okay. Or no French subway. bread? Well, let's see. Subway. Let's see if we can figure it out from the title. I knew. So the title is Defamer by Shane Jones. Okay. Shane Jones is the author of the novels Lightboxes, Daniel Fights a Hurricane, and Crystal Eaters. Um, How do I even get these out? I'm looking for 50. No! I wonder if um, no, I Henry. Crystal Eaters might have been on my TBR at some point. Uh, if so, that's really great because it's one of those books I really meant to read ah! and I just didn't get to. All right, boys, take it easy. Um, do you want me to read the first bit, guys? Dancing with D. Dancing with D. Boys, do you want me to read the first bit? Are you yeah. listen? Okay. <laughs> Big Boss takes a four-hour lunch. He has suffered no major disasters in his life. Occasionally, he calls a former co-worker on the death of the former co-worker's mother or father. He's very good at it. His wife photographs the flowers yeah, around their mailbox, and together see. they enjoy planning their vacation to Maine a year in advance. This is one way to live. Okay, interesting. Um, so I will report back. This is a longer story, about 20 pages. And um, I think that's it for today. Maybe. Dancing with Jesus, yes. Maybe we'll read this to the boys this morning. <laughs> and probably have to answer many uncomfortable questions. <laughs> Alright guys, let's say goodbye for today. Bye! Bye! Bye.